this is the second method for installing the WordPress uh, plugin. You can do this with other plugins as well. So, but uh, basically, in order to do this, you need to make sure that you have a uploads folder in the wp-content directory that has uh, the read write execute permissions. It'd be I think chmod, um, and it'd be seven 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 would be the number if, if you use that for uh, permissions. Otherwise, uh, you can do it to the entire wp-content directory, give it those permissions, but I don't suggest that. I would just do it to the uploads directory. If you don't have that directory, make it inside the wp-content directory and then change the permissions so that it has read, write, execute um, permissions for all the users and groups. Uh, from that point, you can download the zip file from the plugin directory on wordpress.org and once you have it downloaded to your machine, I put mine in the downloads folder. You'll come to your dashboard in your WordPress install and choose add new. From there you can go to the upload in the top right, uh, top left there. Now choose file and we're going to look for that zip file that we created. And open that. Now that might be wherever you stored it, your desktop, your download folder, wherever that is. But once you find it and locate it, you'll choose that file, you'll choose install now should bring you to a point here to log in for your FTP information. You'll click proceed once you enter that in and it should tell you that it's installed successfully. Uh, from that point you can activate the plugin and once it's activated you'll notice here that this is the initial install so we still need to set it up. Um, it's really quick to do that. We're just going to enter in the cookie expiration. We're going to do this once every minute and we're going to save the save it so it shows the credits. Once those changes are made, it's been installed. So uh, if you don't have uh, the ability to change the permissions, um, the only other way that I know you could do that is you could unzip the directory or the plugin on your computer, and then you should have a five-star rating directory that is that gets unzipped. You'd want to make sure you upload that directory to your wp-content forward slash plugins directory and it's basically going to be a directory inside of the plugins directory. Uh, some people try to upload the zip file there. That's not the proper way of doing it. Um, you'll need to look at the WordPress documentation on, on how to properly install those. But th these are the two methods that are available through WordPress. Is, um, either searching through the WordPress repository of plugins or uploading it manually using the zip file. Thank you.